Welcome back, reading the Bible with Loke. We over a hundred now, so we experienced. <laughs> we experienced now. Yeah. All right, Job 22. Elipha, can a vigorous man be of use to God? I heard that used in the other in the sentence the other day. I was just like, I don't know if or a wise man be useful to himself. Is it any pleasure or joy to the Almighty that you are righteous? Or is it a benefit to him that you make your ways perfect? Is it because of your fear of him that he corrects you that he enters into judgment against you? Is not your wickedness great and your sins without end? For you have taken pledges of your brothers without cause and stripped men naked. You have not given water to the weary to drink, and you have withheld bread from the hungry. But the land is possessed by the man with power, and the favored and honorable man dwells in it. You have sent widows away empty-handed. And the arm strength of the fatherless have been broken. Therefore, a snare surrounds you. And sudden dread terrifies and overwhelms you. Or darkness so that you cannot see and a flood of water covers you. Is not God in the height of heaven? I'm going to use that in prayer. God, I know that you are in the height of heaven. Yeah, let me use that. And behold, the distant stars, how high they are. You say, what does God know about me? Let's write down height of heaven real quick. I don't even want a chance that I might forget it. My God. I might even throw a little swag on there and say the heights of heaven, you know what I'm saying? in parentheses, you know what I'm saying? Like that right now. Writing on this book so hard. <laughs> pause, pause. Everybody says pause for everything, man. It's crazy. Like, let it go. It's pause and no pause. You're the same person. All right? All right, here we go. Thick clouds. We're starting right back. I think that's 14. Thick clouds are a hiding place for him so that he cannot see. And he walks on the vault of the heavens. Will you keep to the ancient path that wicked men walked in the time of Noah? Men who were snatched away before their time, whose foundations were poured out like a river. They say to God, depart from us. What can the Almighty do for us or to us? Yet he filled their houses with good things, but the counsel of the wicked and ungodly is far from me. The righteous see it and are glad, and the innocent mock and laugh at them, saying, Surely our adversaries are cut off and destroyed, and fire has consumed their abundance. Now yield and submit yourself to him, agree with God, and conform to his will, and be at peace. In this way you will prosper and great good will come to you. Pre please receive the law and instruction from his mouth and establish his words in your heart and keep them. If you return to the Almighty and submit your humble and submit and humble yourself before him, you will be built up and restored. If you remove unrighteousness far from your tents and place your gold in the dust, and the gold of fear among the stones of the brooks, considering it of little value, and make the Almighty your gold and your precious silver, then you will have delight in the Almighty, and you will lift up your face to God. You will pray to him, and he will hear you, and you will pay your vows. You will also decide and decree a thing, and it will be established for you, and the light of God's favor will shine upon your ways. 
When you are cast down and humbled, you will speak with confidence and the humble person, he will lift up and save. He will even rescue the one for whom you intercede who is not innocent, and he will be rescued through cleanliness of your hands. All right. It's just a lot of talking, man. Y'all. Now Job learns why. All right. Job over here hurting. I just don't know how I be talking that much. I'm hurting my head. All right. Here go, go Job 23 2. Even today, my complaint is contentious. contentious. His hand is heavy despite my groaning. Oh, that I knew where I might find him, that I might come to his seat. I would present my cause before him and fill my mouth with arguments. I would learn the words which he would answer and understand what he would say to me. Would he contend against me with his great power? No, surely he would give attention to me. There the righteous and upright could reason with him, so I would be acquitted forever by my judge. Behold, I go forward to the east, but he is not there. I go backward to the west, but I cannot perceive him. To the left, north, he turns, but I cannot behold him. He turns to the right hand, but I cannot see him. But he knows the way that I take, and he pays attention to it. When he has tried me, I will come forth as refined gold. Mm, I felt that. So no matter what you're going through, just know once you get out of it, you're going to be a refined gold, a refined stone. I feel that myself. <laughs> I'm ready to be refined. <laughs> I'm ready to be refined. I right, meet my feet have carefully followed his steps. I have kept his ways and not turned aside. I will come forth as a refined. Let me write that down real quick. I don't know how to use that too. I don't know how, but let me use I'll take all these notes one day. Who knows? I don't know, but I'm writing it down. Just because I know how I retain stuff, I will. I was say now. I will this can be a day where I'll come forth as a refined gold. You stuck in what it looks like now, but I know one day I'll come forth as a refined gold. All right. My feet have carefully followed his steps. I have kept his ways and not turned aside. I have not departed from the commandment of his lips. I have kept the words of his mouth more necessary than my food. That's a nap. Boy, I don't like their nats at the office here. They just be hanging out. I try to make sure there ain't nothing they can eat on, you know what I'm saying? Like, no nothing. Bread comb, nothing, nothing, nothing. I just try to, and they still just be hanging out and shit. My bad. <laughs> they just be hanging out, man. All right, let's go. Um, but he is unique and unchangeable, and who can turn him? And what his soul desires that he does, for he performs what is planned, appointed for me, and he is mindful of many such things. Therefore, I will be terrified at his presence when I consider I tremble in dread of him. For God, my heart faint. For God has made my heart faint, and the Almighty has terrified me, but I am not silenced by the darkness of the woes that fell on me, nor by the darkness which covers my face. He said, I have kept the words of his mouth more necessary than my food. Maybe... Maybe um, someone uh, in a different journey can possibly use that to where, you know, obviously a higher level than, than me. I don't, I, I don't, not that I'm, I'm just not at that level to where 
Like I still, you know what I'm saying. Sometimes, you know, a little little word may slide out there and there. So, but um, I have kept the words of his mouth more necessary than my food. So you mean tell me like when you wake up in the morning, you get that word. It's that when I go get a snack, you go get that word. When I go to lunch, you go get that word. When I have a, a thirst for water, you go get that word. <sighs> That's what I'm saying. That's next level. That's next level. That's heavy. That's heavy. And Job hurting. We ain't talking about somebody regular that's moving around. Job hurting. Boils up this right here and this right here. Skin funny, peeling off, all, all that. He still, uh, let me, uh, nah. It's heavy. That's heavy. Anyway, reading the Bible alone. I think I got one more this week, so stay tuned. Like I said, we over 100 now. We over 100 now, so stay with me.